everybody. So despite the pandemic, despite everything, I'm still looking to tick off a few bucket list items. And the other week was no different. Being in Canada, one of the things you can definitely do that you can't do in Australia is ice fishing. Ice fishing. Ice fishing. Ice fishing. We've got ice fishing. Basically what included in this package was fishing tackle, skidoo ride, and a couple of holes in the ice. I've been on a skidoo for over 20 years, so doing it for two kilometers over ice was unreal. excited that I didn't realize how cold my ears were until we got there. Hey, we're in a lake. Now when it comes to ice fishing, I had a preconceived idea of what ice fishing was. You have a hole in the hut and that's about it. Boy, I was dead wrong. When our mate dropped us off, I grabbed a huge screwdriver looking drill, walked out onto the ice and drilled five holes into one and a half meter thick ice. Now for anyone that lives in the Northern Hemisphere where it does snow and ice is everywhere, this probably won't come as a big deal to you. But to an Australian, where literally the average temperature is well above zero degrees, this was unbelievable. At like a meter and a half of ice below us, holding us up over eight meters of water. What? And now we're down there, 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 there. Check on the holes every 30 to 40 minutes. How you going, Sal? Pretty good. Hey, so you enjoyed this ride? Yes, I do. <laughs> I feel like a local. Uh, so in the meantime, we're playing cards. Don't feel me. <laughs> we're eating. Keeping warm by the fire. At the end of the day, when the guys came to pick us up, we'd been fishing for over five hours and we caught absolutely nothing. Despite the lack of fish, it was a sensational day. Had an amazing time, literally doing nothing but chilling out because there was no signal out there. And it was bliss. Um, if you guys have been ice fishing out there, let us know how it went. So that's all I got for now. I hope to catch you guys next week.